Hey, what's up, YouTube? Get some luck here, and I'm going to be showing you how to make the paper snake dragon. Yeah, I kind of decided to make this because um, I bet you guys are just too lazy to go to my old channel and just watch it. So I'm just going to make it to this channel, and yeah. Plus, I have nothing to do, so well, let's get started. So you want to use a square sheet of paper, fold, fold both diagonals, and then fold both uh, corners to the middle, just to opposite sides though because now we're going to switch it to the other side and do the same thing then we want to put all the four corners into the middle Yeah, after that, you get something like this. Then you want to take out two flaps, um, and then, and then in one of the two flaps, you see this part right here. You want to open it out. Uh, actually, let me show you this way. So, yeah, you see this part. You open it out. Then, wait, why is this so confusing? Ooh. Oh, yeah. Okay, after you took it out, uh, how do I show it like that? Okay. After taking out, I fold this one down. Take this, and you see the crease here. Then you want to fold it up, and then just take this part and fold it down. There, then do the other way. Then. Squash fall into your square base. Yeah, did the same thing with the other side. Yeah, after you got that, you get this part. Then you want to fold the line between there, and not not the square, in half. Like that, you get something like this. Then you want to open it. You see this part right here? You take it out. Take it out, and then. Just crease it. Other side too. Take it out and crease it. You can send it like this. Then you want to make a a pedal fold. So you take this, fold it to the middle. Oh. 
and fold this down. Open it. Take one flap of this right here. Uh, bring it up all the way to the crease we just made right here. Then, yeah, that's how you make a pedophile, then just crease the part. I might show you how to make the other videos that I made long time ago in my Maple Story Guy channel. That channel was trying to make for Maple Story, but it fails. Okay, you get a pedophile, do it with the other side. So now that you know, I can do this a lot faster. So you get that. Then you want to take, you, you want to put it down, and then you get to this, this part right here. You want to fold it downwards into the crease that we made. Right here. You see that crease? Yeah, you want to fold it down. Right. Down. You get that? A headless thingy? I don't know. But do with the other side too, because we're gonna making. Uh, sorry, we're gonna be making a sink board. That phone thing just ruins the moment. Oops, I went ahead, so I gotta start over. Okay, so. After that part, you want to take this out. You see this part here? Pull it, push it down. And then you see like a square shape right here. You want to crease on all of the sides. Then you want to take these two and push them in. And crease this down. So yeah, that's how you make a sink fold. And just put it down like that. Do it with the other side. Push this side. Please don't all of them. Actually, this might look better. For some reason. So you get that part, just headless. And then what you want to do here is you want to take this, fold it down, and this too. Then you want to squash fold, open these two up, and then crease it right in the line of this. Thingy. You get that, and then do it the other side. Open it up. Then you wanna just just take that and go the other way. Yeah, just do that. Or you can just leave it like this, because we're just going to do something else with this one. Now all you want to do is make a pedophile out of it. How? Well, you want to take this, lift it up, push this down. Mm. Then you can do this part, just, just pretend it's like a pedophile here, just crease it, crease it right here on both sides and you're done. And then pu push it down, of course.
You kill something like this. Yeah, just leave it up like that. Then you wanna just fold this up. Just keep that. Do with the other side. Look at that. Take this, pour it down. Then take these two and put put it in the middle. Crease it in the middle. Kinda. Yes, no. I don't know. What am I talking about? Oh whatever. You get that. Do it with the other side. Bring this down. Crease it. Look at that. Then you want to take only one side, okay? And you put it down all the way. And you get that. Now what you want to do here, take all, all sides right here. You want to fold it all the way to the middle. Just like that. Do with all the other sides. Last one. Okay, you get something like this. Yeah. Then turn the other side and put this up. Something happened here. Oh, that's why I hate this always on me. Well, doesn't matter. Then you got this part. Looks like a long line thingy. Then you want to take these flaps right here. On the bottom. You want to fold it all the way into this part right here. Up. Then after that, you see this, the, this thing right here, yeah, you want to fold it upwards, till you get this, do it with the other side, put it upwards, Yeah, then after that, just want to fold, you just want to take this, fold it kind of upwards, towards, or even the flaps down here, upwards, and then fold it down. Get something like that. It's going to be swings. Now, the one that this is facing up, that's going to be your head. Looks obvious, so yeah. So what you want to do here is you want to for, for the head, you want to fold this head down, make it like a crane head, then fold it up to make it a dragon head, and. 
Yeah, that's all. That's the horns. Well, we're not done yet, so... Let's get on with the tail. Now, you do the same thing. You fold it down like a crane head. Up like a dragon head. And then down again. Yeah. This is a tiny paper, so it's going to be hard. Oh, whatever. Then you want to like twist it the other way. The way to make it look like it's just going the other way. Like that. Then you see the wings. You know, fold them up. All the way. Then down. And down and down until you reach the this part right here. That's hard to crease. And that's all. The snake dragon. And thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.